EA Sports Active personal trainer for the Nintendo Wii. This game starts off in the most delicate feminine way. They must have done some market research and come to the conclusion that their primary audience for this game is women. Which it probably is, but this game is really cool for us fellas too. Us beer drinking, hamburger eating, video game playing on the couch fellas. Men, are you with me? If playing Dead Space is not burning enough calories to work off last night's happy hour, you could try playing Dead Space while standing up and moving around. If that doesn't work for you, then try EA Sports Active Personal Trainer. Although considering that EA has the license for Dead Space, I think they could combine the two games. I'll get into that more later. One of my favorite features in this particular disc is the fact that you can build your own workout from a variety, a large variety, of cardiovascular activities, imitation sports, and leg and arm exercises. Or you can choose from a number of easy or hard exercise routines that are already created for the game. One of the features I enjoy is that it projects how many calories you're going to burn off for your exercise routine and the length of the routine. So that if you're making a program to burn off the three beers that you just drank the night before or the giant bucket of cheese fries that you had for lunch, you can make a program to do that and make it interesting and fun. Since I know none of you want to watch me do the exercises in this game, we'll watch the lady in the game. EA Sports Active Personal Trainer comes complete with this game disc for the Nintendo Wii and a resistance band, a giant rubber band that you use for the arm exercises and shoulder exercises, as well as a leg strap where you put the nunchuck for the running exercises. There's demonstration videos showing how to do each of the exercises in the game and the girl is always smiling. I think she's a replicant. The leg strap and nunchuck configuration of this game makes running very possible right in front of your television. Believe it or not, it works extremely well. It's like Dune, except you're traveling nowhere while not moving anywhere either. Good job! You're looking like a track star with the pace that you're setting. Oh yeah, I look like a track star no matter what I do. The constant positive reaffirmation from the trainer can be switched off. But I left it on for this review. Some of the exercises like the lunges have a serious delay from what you're doing to what you actually see on the screen. Others do not. The boxing and the running in particular are very real time for the most part. It's surprising how well this thing actually knows what you're doing and how your form is. Squat. I need someone to tell me what a great job I'm doing. Squat. Fantastic effort so far. Work your thighs and own the squat. Keep this it game, well, it's not really a game, but this workout disc uses the Wii controller, the unique Wii controller and nunchuck very well. You can't exactly run around all over the place on the track and like run into people or punch them out. You've got this. But it can definitely tell how fast or slow you're running or walking. Step back. Lunge right. Hands down. Hands down. Now pull the sword out of your enemy. Nice. Nice cadence. Staying in that zone is going to give you the best results. I think they should have had a button at the beginning of the game where you could choose whether or not you're a man or a woman playing EA Sports Active. Because while the game is excellent the way it is, there should have been a guy's version where you're wearing a Viking helmet while running. Or even better, you could be running as Isaac from Dead Space. How cool would that be if Isaac was the trainer in this game? This is made for guys. Look, there's punching exercises. Instead of punching a harmless machine, you should be punching zombies or the undead. Everybody knows that. Punch the bag. Where's the incentive? Bag doesn't hit back. If your character slows down, the bag should reach out and tear your avatar's head off and then stomp on it. That would be motivation. Right on! Very intense and very productive. You're in control as you get 
better, we'll combine more of them to create more challenging sequences for you. Let me reiterate, you can shut off the voice. And one more thing, she looks like she's having a great time dancing. It's like the Macarena, which makes me think of margaritas. Now, how many leg kicks do I have to do to burn off one giant margarita the size of Rhode Island? You're doing awesome. Keep it up. See, that's why this game makes sense. You can calculate ahead of time just how bad you can be and get away with it. Oh, this is the hardest exercise in the game by far. After you've already done a whole lot of running and squatting in the exercise routine, you're squatting down and your character is squatting to gain speed and then you jump up when you hit the jumps. And if you jump at the right time, he does a trick in the air. Your hard work is definitely paying off with this performance. You're slipstreaming. That's a tough one. That'll definitely give your legs a workout. In fact, this whole game will give you a workout. If you're a video gamer looking to get in shape, don't just laugh at these interactive sports exercise training games. They're, they're not really games. This one is a personal trainer, as the packaging says. And it does keep things interesting by mixing it up with lots of different activities, exercises. You can do arms one day, legs the next day, and that's really what you should do. You should mix it up. Maintain and down. Curl right arm. And down. Great determination today. You're totally on your game. This disc would be perfect for people living in apartments in the middle of winter. It's like the George Foreman grill of exercise games. At the heart of this game is the leg strap. I think that's what really makes a big difference because they found a way to make running work on the Wii. Now you're jogging in place, but you're doing it in a confined space. And if you're stuck in an apartment in the middle of winter, or you just don't have time to get outside or finish work late and it's the middle of the night, it's the running, I think, that really makes a difference in this game. And the giant rubber band works very well for the arm and shoulder exercises. Extend right arm and back. That's it. You're looking very motivated. Yes, this game is compatible with the Wii balance board. It does work with it. You're coming on strong and really taking control here. You're showing that you can get fit and have fun doing it. However, I don't have one, so I couldn't test that feature in the game. So it also works without the Wii balance board. The tennis exercises were fun. I wasn't as wild about the volleyball, but tennis worked really well in here. Get back into the game. This exercise isn't over yet. They should have replaced the trainer with Robofish from Time Splitters. Hey, wait, that was published by EA. Why don't they do that? Keep up this good pace and don't lose your focus no matter what. You made that look easy. I need to be told again how well I've done. That was 110%. That's right, 110% awesome. Now, it's time to celebrate my victory. By balancing a healthy diet with a suitable exercise program, you can work on either losing weight or building muscle. I'd like you to take a moment to celebrate. You've accomplished a genuine achievement on your own personal journey towards improved fitness and taken a big step towards a healthier lifestyle.